Hello! In this video, I'm going to show you how to clean your dog's teeth. Now, I know what you might be thinking, but I don't even want to clean my own teeth. But don't worry, it's really easy. Hey guys, I'm going to show you a couple of ways to take good care of your dog's teeth. Um, now, really important, you should have a few toys for your dog, and each dog is different, so just find out what works for your dog. Um, something that's really good is a toy like this. Um, rope toys are supposed to be good for dog's teeth because as they chew on the ropes, the, the rope will help to clean their teeth, and um, something like this would encourage them to play with it. This is kind of a rubbery ball that's in the middle of the rope. It has little bumps all over it and I think that this helps them too. Um, another really good material for toys is something like this. This one's kind of gross because it's all chewed up already, but they still love it. Um, this material is called Nylabone, so as they chew down on the material, there's little fibers, and you know it's completely safe for them, um, and the little fibers actually help to brush their teeth as they chew on it. And this toy actually has um, a few elements right here, kind of the rubbery, bumpy texture, and then in here, bristles that they can chew on. Um, and this one you can take apart and put little treat discs inside to encourage them to play with it. Now, when I first got my first dog, we went to the pet store and I looked for doggy toothpaste. Now, this was the first one that I bought. Um, there were many different flavors, like chicken and beef, and what I wanted was something that would actually smell good on their breath. So I thought, mint, mint is the way to go. Well, you can see here, I've had my dog for about two years now, and this tube is like completely full. Um, the reason for this is because my dogs do not like mint, so, you know, I guess you have to choose what your dog likes instead of what you think would be good. So the way that the doggy toothpaste works is that you, you, when you are first introducing it to your dog, you just squirt some on your finger, you hold it up to your dog, you let them sniff it and lick it. If they seem into it, maybe you can start putting your finger in their mouths and rubbing their teeth and gums to get them used to the sensation. Um, now, when I did this to Nico, he did not like it. Obviously, mint was not his flavor of choice, so... I had to go back to the store and find something else for him. Okay, Nico, sit. All right, so this is Nico, and um, you can see he's kind of getting excited because he sees the toothbrush, he knows what's coming, he really likes this toothpaste. Now, I'm just going to put some of this toothpaste on the toothbrush. So when you're first starting out, your dog might think it's really weird that you're brushing his teeth. So um, what you're supposed to do is kind of just let them lick it a little, let them get used to this object, get used to the toothpaste. Um, what I like to do is kind of rub it uh, around their mouth. So some of the toothpaste is already st stuck around his lips and stuff, and he's licking it a lot, um, which is a good sign. And since Nico's really used to this, you need to take it slow, but um, he's used to this already. I'm going to go ahead and start rubbing it against his teeth. He kind of backs backs up a little, you see, because it's, it's weird. It's a little weird. And for me, um, you, you usually hold on to their neck or at the top of their head a little bit to get better leverage. Um, my vet said that it's fine just to brush the, the outside of their teeth. Um, and not the inner part, but what I do is, so I put it in, into their cheek, and I kind of just rub it around really fast like this, like little motions. If you're going in and out too fast, you might actually, you know, hurt the inside of their cheek or poke their eye out, I mean, who knows. So just be careful. Nico's doing really well. Oh, uh, um, another thing is the toothbrushes. Now, this is the toothbrush that I currently use. It's just a Colgate brand toothbrush, you know, um, kind of your average common toothbrushes that you can buy anywhere. 
My first one was a toothbrush that we bought at the pet store. Now, I think they're completely overpriced. They're like maybe like $7 or around there. And I honestly think that these um, brand name human toothbrushes are probably even better because they're much cheaper. I bet this was like, these are probably 2 or $3. Um, maybe you can even find them at a dollar store.